The Charger is the scaling class. Like mentioned in the other video, Charger starts every life at zero charge. Locking an attack, landing an M1, or using your skill one grants you charge. You want to get to 11 charge as fast as possible, as your class goes from barely functional to being able to kill off of two confirms. This is what I despise about Ranger. Not... Okay, that's... How? Well, your M1 damage scales with charge. Your S1 can combo extend at above 11 charge. Your SP now has a combo starting slash extending attack attached to it, and the distance it travels increases. In other words, you get your combo tools at 11 charge. So, what combo should you do at 11 charge? Well, you honestly just need to learn one combo as the charger. Once you hit it, you can path into any of your moves. And I mean any. Okay, so what's the combo? M1 hold, M1, SP, M1 hold, S1, boom. You can go anywhere from here. And I'm not speaking metaphorically. The charger can combo into literally their whole kit from landing that. You can do anything. Do you want to loop the exact same thing? You can do that. Do you want to use your grab so then you can combo extend even further? You can do that. Do you want to use your rip space? You can do that. It's so stupid how many options Charger gets at 11 charge. Like, this is a move to get people who are far away from you closer to you so you can combo them. But with this combo and predation, you can use it mid combo? Like, what? what is this class? It's probably, it's still low tier, honestly. The strength of the Charger comes from if your opponent just holds down W and runs into all of your shit. The moment someone starts backing away from you, the class shows its issues. But it's still really fun to play, so I have a blast on it. Oh, and if you do try to play the Charger and land these combos, be sure to tap SP when you're trying to use it. Because if you hold it down, the game may think you're trying to rip space. And it gets cancelled, and you just wasted all your charge. Oh, another thing. It's generally not advised to use your skill 2 because of the charge loss, but you should use it if it'd kill your opponent. Learning this combo is actually pretty helpful, because if you land a stray move from this combo, you'll know what it combos into, so you can freestyle even better. I don't really have much of a rating, because the charger just feels like one of those fighting game characters where they land any confirm on you, and then they just do the same combo the whole fucking match, and the worst part is, it does half of your HP, so if you make two mistakes, you're dead. <coughs> I wonder what game I could be talking about. Anyways, here are all the combos that I found, slash, were sent, and modified. Uh, these are pretty much your bread and butters. You can go and experiment and find your own combos, but this is pretty much the best you can find, question mark. I don't know, I don't main this class. I might though, it's really fun, but god, I don't want to fight the gunner. Yeah, and that's the video. Thank you for watching. Uh, I think I'll do Vigilante next, maybe the Ranger, but I don't know. If you enjoyed it, uh, please subscribe, as only like 2% of you are subscribed, I don't know. I don't really care too much, but it would be a uh, nice reception. Alright, this has been Agent. Bye bye. Uh, I didn't realize you could, uh, turn it. Okay. <laughs>